Hello Pisces, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing your bonus channel reading between June 1 to 7. Let's see the messages for you. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, Sun, Pisces, Fish, Cross, Watchers. For personal readings, white spells, premium charge crystals, reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. All the details are given down below in the description box. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more videos on your sign. Let's see Pisces what's coming in for you. June bonus 1 to 7, first week. Wow. Someone is in love with you and is coming towards you. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Libra. But they're a little hesitant. They're like, they don't know how you're going to respond to it, whether you're going to like it, whether you're going to reject them. There's a lot of fear around that. This person is scared that what if uh, they get heartbroken? There's someone that deeply loves you, but is hesitating to tell you the truth. Okay? Let's see. The, another reason why they're not coming towards you is they see you as someone that is beyond their league. Like you are better than her or him. Okay, you're better than them. And uh, you make more money than them. How they see you is you're more powerful than them. Or they see you as someone that is more older and wiser than them. So why would you choose them? That's what they think. Some of you could be married and this person is unmarried so that's also one of the things for some of you are their senior this person has a lot of emotions but they see you as someone that is more richer financially status wise knowledge wise position wise than them they could be an aries that's how they see you they see you as someone that is also full of ego <laughs> okay so they do see that but they don't disrespect you for this reason. They feel like they're proud of the fact that you've made so much for yourself. So you deserve that kind of, you know, attitude. So they like your attitude. Some of you, you stopped talking to this person altogether. You blocked this person or they got angry at you and they blocked you in a half. And since that day, you stopped talking to this person. Now they're like, oh, when will they unblock me? Or... I've unblocked them. When will they respond to my messages? There is a fear. Okay. This person did something because of which they're feeling extremely guilty. And now they want to, you know, improve everything. They want to come towards you with this energy of let's get back together. But they're scared of you. They're scared of your aura. Page of Pentacles. They're very slow in action because they're worried how you're going to take this. Every time they're writing something and then they're deleting it. Sometimes they unblock you and then they block you back. Because they don't have the guts, the courage. Considering what they did in the past is also causing them a lot of guilt. They can't even say sorry because they're scared of you. And they see you as someone that does not want to get bothered. That's how they feel. There's still a lot of passion, guys. There's oozing passion. Like, it's, it's blowing uh, this person's mind. The way they have being passionately craving you okay the oozing passion okay that will blow your mind when you come to know that that's how passionate they are for you they're still craving you they're still lingering for you they're still wishing for you they're still crying for you they still want to contact you they still want to talk to you so they have a lot of feelings inside of them that they have kept it to themselves okay considering the outcome they think it's not gonna work out as you didn't try or you didn't respond so they were they're like okay i think it's me they see this as a one-sided thing so ace of wands is like they have a lot of passion like it's it's just going out of control okay they have fountain of emotions for you oozing passion and the love they have for you is going to drive you crazy if you find out it will blow your mind okay the kind of emotions they've kept inside for you Knight of Wands my gosh there will be a communication happening they won't be able to control themselves they're coming I feel like you guys will stumble upon each other through work or they're going to meet you at your workplace you're going to meet them at their workplace without realizing you guys are going to meet this person is not going to meet you intentionally I feel you guys will stumble upon each other and it has to do with work. You guys meeting at the same bank or at the same uh, institution or at the same something like that. And at that time, you're paying someone or you're doing some work. And at that point of time, you'll be looking at it and you'll be like, let me not let go of this opportunity. They will try upon you. They'll find it more easier to try upon you. 
and they'll make sure that they show you a best you know uh, impression they give you a best impression they'll also act like you are the one that makes them happy okay you will see a huge happiness on their face as if they've achieved something okay they wish to be with you i feel like their their wish is going to come true at least to meet you once again something to do with them asking for one more chance in love universe is granting them so their wish their manifestations will come true with them coming towards you the hierophant the fool i'm seeing that this is someone that is confirm me this could be a taurus this could be a an aquarius but what does this mean the hierophant and the fool the world most probable outcome between the two of you yeah i feel like you guys are getting back as friends but i'm not seeing there's a proper communication regarding marriage happening because you will tell them that either you're already engaged or you're happy wherever you are i'm also seeing the way you're going to respond to this person will help them release the baggage that they were carrying from this long time it will also give them a closure if you're not interested in this person so that they can move to the next phase in their life but they will be so happy so so happy to meet you that they will not think about wanting to have you back in their life they'll just be happy to see you growing to see you um making your money um raising your standards growing and you know doing the best i feel they will congratulate you and feel good about you so i feel i'm also seeing there will be a short meeting at a cafe you guys will go and talk over there and that might be the last or you guys may get into some sort of a partnership which will become totally professional or only friendly like uh, you guys may get back with friendship but i'm not seeing a relationship happening again i'm seeing you guys will like come to a neutral grounds and they will get a closure but i'm seeing you will see how respect how much respect they feel towards you you'll be shocked to see the way they are respecting you the way they're treating you they are the complete opposite you didn't know that this person has such a big heart in the past they were not being honest they might be a third party in the past i'm also seeing when they come into your life um uh, back at that point of time you're already with someone else maybe already married so they will be like congratulating you giving you blessings and they will decide to not interfere and that will be the time where they will be moving on so this is going to happen guys it might take a long time but it is going to happen trust me they will come towards you okay right now they're just like feeling doomed they know you will not take this person's offer or you're already with someone else yes they will see you as someone that is just mining your own business and you're also wanting you're only wanting to connect with this person there is work involved otherwise nothing so you're keeping it highly professional when you meet this person and you're also you also will be closed off completely closed off when they see you when they meet you strength they'll see you as someone that is very strong very independent and i'm seeing you guys will change this person's attitude towards you as well they will become more professional towards you guys will get into some sort of a professional work or partnership and forget about love that's highly possible oh my gosh don't try don't tell me this can also evolve into love now there is a 50 50% chance because overthinking when this person comes into your life you will overthink you will be like i think this person loves me i should give them a chance somewhere you will overthink okay and this can end into a beautiful relationship chances are you will be running away from them and they'll be trying but if at one point at any point you both are doing the same thing trying to work on this connection and when your energies align that's when this connection will work out but there is 50 50 chance either this connection will work out or you will walk out I'm also seeing that family is involved, which is why you guys cannot choose this person. Sudden wealth, thief. 
someone that took away money from you is going to come back with money your uh, stuck money is being released or if you were in a debt situation money is coming towards you someone from a long distance is finally going to lend you back your lost money something like that is happening some of you are going to get the property retreat love yourself first Pisces, you're more interested in staying alone than with the wrong person. So all you're doing right now, Pisces, is just self-love. Okay? You're in love with yourself. You don't care about a thing. Okay? All you care about is just self-love, Pisces. Because you know very soon you're going to meet your soulmate and you only open up your heart to one person. Until then, your heart is closed. I wish I could take back my words. This person will apologize to you as well. Because... When they see, when they meet you, I'm seeing that they will try to convince you, okay, for a while. But they can sense that you're no longer interested. You're no, no longer into them, Pisces. This person could be a teacher, you could be a teacher or something like school. You guys may meet at a school, at an institution, very highly likely. And then I'm seeing there's something about you that attracts this person. It's an X factor. This you is one of a kind, very different from others. And they're ready to move mountains for you. If you give them a chance, they'll do anything for you. This person is like hell crazy about you. Literally, very much. They can't stop thinking about you, whether this is. I feel a real reason why you've changed this person into falling in love with you is, is your confidence. Your strength, the way you have managed to change yourself with this person's actions and not look back and kept on moving forward and uh, dealing with challenges head on and changing your life for good. This person has become nuts over you, crazy over you. But you're looking for someone that respects you, that loves you, that is honest with you, meets you on the same page. So you don't see this person as... The correct person for you so i'm seeing you are forgiving them but you're not giving them another shot in love but there will always be a 50 50 opportunity with this person there is a chance guys if you're looking for an opportunity to reunite then it's probably within four weeks or four months because this person's still thinking what is the best thing to do right now they will be apologizing forgiveness advice please yeah they really like you keep it real they really like that you're so honest and the way you look you have nothing done on you or just the way you are you present yourself uh true to your personality okay this could be a scorpio this person is at a long distance or this is someone that sees you as A forgotten or kind of like how do you say it? you know unfinished business they know there will be a meeting one day they know, they know this thing they think that you've forgotten them you moved on you changed that's how they see you you're not the same person anymore you don't even think about this person anymore that's how they see you and that's why they're scared they also have this feeling that you might be with someone else having fun probably got married or something like that that's the fear that they're carrying with them. This person knows that whoever you're going to be with, you're going to love that person a lot. Okay? They think you're in love with someone else. Yes, there's someone else in the picture. That's, that's what they feel. Probably a Gemini you're with. They've been secretly spying on you. Let me tell you that. Okay. Let me see what are the signs you'll be dealing with. Okay. You have... Pisces, another Pisces, you have Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, or you have Libra. Okay, these are the most probable signs, Pisces. Now, let's see what else. From Aries to Pisces, your person's feelings. Aries is obsessed with your body or your money, your status. Taurus is overly thinking about things, not taking action. They're too lazy as well. The Gemini wants to create problems for you. They don't want to see you with anyone else. They don't want to see you happy. The Cancer person wants to settle down with you. They see a future with you. The Leo, they are very excited to get to know you. This person sees you as a dream person and they are waiting for you to propose them. Virgo. 
lying constantly. Don't trust them, Libra. Libra wants their space, so they're just uh, wanting to chill out with you right now. Scorpio, they're taking a lot of stress around you, not talking to them. Sagittarius, they're, they're, they're jealous. They're also gossiping behind your back. This person wants to always pick a fight as well. Love, hate, and only hate of you. Capricorn, this person wants to come towards you, but someone is coming between you and them. Someone is stopping them rigorously. Capricorn, they really are obsessed with the way you are as a person. They think you're an extremely loving soul, but they don't deserve you. They're not as uh, high in status or money. They think they're just a loser and you'll never choose them. Pisces. Forbidden love. Aquarius forbidden love. Pisces, this person is anxious. They thought that you're going to reach out to them. You will talk to them, but it didn't happen. And now they're in this fear that you may have moved on, forgotten about them. But they're stuck here. They don't know what to do. It's too late for them. So this is what is bothering. You or your person could be into spirituality, could be into arts. I do. Oh my gosh. You're soon getting married to someone. Who is that person? I'm seeing you will lay a solid foundation. I'm also seeing marriage for you. Your person has I, D, A and O in their name. Or this person has a business. Or you have a business idea that will take you a long way. Also, you're dealing with someone that could be older than you. And I'm also seeing this person is highly selective. They could be a virgin. They could be a celibate. Yes, someone wants a reunion like crazy. Okay, this person also has A and F. They are far away from you. A, F. Okay, they're crazy as heck. They want to marry you as heck. So, yeah. So, Fatima could be the name. Fardin could be the name. Farah could be the name. So, more like Islamic names as well. English names, I'm seeing. Indian names. So, you could be from America, India, Pakistan, Afghanistan. Eurasia is also what I'm seeing. Denmark, Canada, France, Finland, Italy. Auckland, Silent, Botswana, Drew could be the name. And then I'm seeing AI again. Someone's, I feel like most of the people watching this are from Asian countries. Travel, are you guys are traveling? Yes, I'm seeing traveling for sure in June month. You may go to China, Japan, Korea, somewhere like that, or Italy, France, Paris, America. And then I'm seeing social media. If someone is popular on social media, you or your person. There's also a possibility of meeting someone through social media. Some of you are working into some of, some of you owns a travel business and very popular on social media or going to be or arts work. Spiritual work is also there. Some of you love to travel blog. L. Alia could be the name as well. I'm seeing falling in love. I'm seeing spiritual. Yes, there's someone that feels spiritually connected to you but is fearful of telling you this. Or you're also going to end up with someone that is a loyal heart. There will be marriage with someone that is loyal to you. Time will tell you who is the one. Someone's name is Arland. Kyla, someone's from Dallas, I'm also seeing Aldo, like working in Aldo or is into shoe wear business, skincare business. Or into medical care doctor Leah could be the name Liam could be the name 
okay so that's about it 36 i hope you enjoyed this wonderful video do like share comment and subscribe come back for more i'll see you back again bye